Hey, it's Friday, October 27th, and today I'm eating this egg. It's Donnie the Chili Mancer, and uh, like I said in the intro, I'm eating this egg. If you are in the know, then you know that this is what's called a dragon's egg, a century egg, or a hundred year egg. Um, Johnny Scoville and Tommy, they've been eating these things lately, so I had a few laying around. I dropped this one just a couple seconds ago, uh, but uh, I have a few of these laying around, so I figured that today while I'm training up my tolerance, uh, I'll use this as the delivery method. Before I do that, it, thanks to everybody who's been watching these videos lately. I have noticed, and uh, please, you know, go ahead and like the videos because it does help. All right, let's get into this one. This is a good one. Uh, I like the texture. I like how it smells kind of off. It's almost got like a... They sometimes call these horse urine eggs because some people think they smell like horse urine. And they're probably right. They do have kind of a... Um, it kind of smells like ammonia. Today, I'm going to be training my tolerance with the... Today's sauce from K-John's, which is one of my favorites. In memorial of it being the previous uh, world record holder, it's the Reaper sauce. Sling blade, hot sauce from K. John's naturally. Uh, this one is made with Carolina Reaper pepper mash and apple cider vinegar and some citrus in there too. So I'm a pretty big fan of the apple cider based sauces. They always taste good uh, on pretty much everything. While I'm cracking this egg open, let's talk about what's going on this weekend in Springfield, Missouri. As any anybody around here knows, uh, I host karaoke on the weekends of Friday and Saturday nights of course, this is the weekend right before Halloween. Halloween is Tuesday, I believe, but Saturday is our party. So we're going to be having a, a pretty big Halloween party. Uh, as you can see on the screen, the winner gets $200 and we're also having a raffle that you can enter where you can win a Jägermeister chiller. So that's pretty chill. You can put that in your man cave or your person cave and and that would be awesome. But dress up Saturday the 28th uh, at Schultz and Dooley's in Chesterfield Village, and you can win. So this is it. This is the century egg. This is the inside of it. Oh yeah, it gets stronger as you open it up. Definitely got an acrid sort of a rotten smell, but it is preserved. It is not rotten. I don't think it's technically rotten. So let's shake the sauce up. Earlier this week, me and E-Man went out to brainstorm for a new podcast or a new channel that we're working on. And we didn't come up with a name because every name that we would come up with, we would Google search or YouTube search, and it was already the name of a podcast or a channel. So we, mm, make a little space there. So we didn't come up with anything. He was wanting something like the revolution or the evolution. I don't need too much. I'm trying to, to train my tolerance up, not uh, test my tolerance. So... He wanted something like the revolution or the evolution. We just couldn't settle on anything because uh, of the way that the internet is. So today we were thinking earlier this morning and we came up with new direction, like the new direction network or the new direction um, channel, you know, uh, something like that. So we started looking at new direction stuff because if you say it out loud, new direction is a lot like new direction which is a lot funnier. So if we could have t-shirts and stuff that say new direction and everybody's like, hey, yeah, I love new direction. I'm like, yeah, everybody needs a new direction. That's pretty funny. That's pretty funny. So I searched on the internet for new direction and I came up with this, the name of a church. Could you imagine going to a church called New Direction and people are like, hey, which church do you go to? And you're like, I go to New Direction Church. And they're like, horrified because... I guess everybody needs a new direction sometimes. All right, guys, this is it. This is the egg. Um, if you would go to a church like that in the comments section, I think it would be kind of cool. But they've got to know what's going on. So uh, bon appetit. Let's do this thing. This is a uh, Carolina Reaper, 100-year-old egg, century egg. Hmm. Hmm. A lot of egg. Mmm. It's quite spicy too. Ooh, it's building now. That's getting crazy. Hell, oh, man. Well, if you haven't checked it out already, uh, the place that I was talking about where I'm going to be doing the the, co the costume contest and the Halloween party on Saturday, 
That's Schultz and Dooley's. It's a lot more than just a bar. Actually, it's a full-on restaurant with delicious food that looks like this. Uh, they also have pool tables and they have uh, a full bar and sports games going on the TVs. We're a lot of fun. Uh, you can come out seven days a week at Schultz and Dooley's, but if you want to come hang out with me, it's every Friday and Saturday night uh, in Springfield, Missouri at 9 p.m. is whenever we start. Man, this, this Carolina Reaper is burning pretty good. I'm getting kind of dewy. I don't know if you guys can see. Ooh. <sighs> All right, guys. Well, that's been, uh, that's been it for me. Uh, the burn, you know, it's a sauce, so it's not burning crazy amounts, but it did taste really good, and that egg is delicious, uh, is delicious too. If you have a chance to try one of them, I definitely recommend it. Again, thank you for coming and hanging out with me today. This has been Donnie the Chili Mancer. Uh, we'll see you soon. Bye.